think this was a 50 year old axe head I decided to make into a Viking Longbeard axe just to see if I could. It worked well. I polished the crap out of it from 125 all the way up to 4000. I painted it with Alkid paint. Then used the transfer paper to get the design I wanted on there. Then used a little scratcher to uh, expose the metal underneath. And uh, I did this for my little brother. And I made a container to put the salt water and vinegar in. And you apply the positive to the axe head or whatever you're etching, the negative to the cage. You let it go until you're happy with however deep it is. And then you use acetone, remove the alkyd paint, and go from there. You can use gun bluing or you can use oil paint to fill in where the uh, it's been etched out. I won't stop till I'm way past the end. Cause I won't feel pain till... Once you begin polishing, all the excess gun blue will be gone. Then shortly after that, I decided to put uh, metal inlay in the wood handle, which was a complete pain in the ass. Supernatural, supernatural, supernatural. a nine millimeter shell on the top of the X handle you can see there the little brass ring uh, I tried doing the leather handle this way didn't like it and then I went with a traditional Viking wrap which is historically accurate hope you enjoyed it the music in this video is owned by and courtesy of Casey James if you would check him out you won't be disappointed hey if you enjoyed this video don't forget to hit like and subscribe thank you